Auntie came breaking nails on hands not even big enough to hold the gun. Kiara Pope, eight years old. Jessica Pope, nine years old. See, Jessica's subconscious is in denial. She wants to believe that Kiara is all fine, alive, trailing her delicate ponytail, who's in plastic barrettes and making her smile. Jessica wonders why her parents picked her up from school early, speeding to Auntie's house like a silver bullet without a signature on it. She sits on love seat, wondering why everyone is crying, whining. Mama collapsed into grandma's open arms. Oh God, while her she was too young. Jessica believed it was a party, sitting, waiting for the music and loud laughter to fill her ignorant ears. Jessica is wondering what he er is. Maybe they can go sneak and eat on my side savings again. They told Jessica she's in a better place that satisfied her heart. Until she saw Kiara closed eyes, still face, no motion. Bang, bang, bang. Jessica is older. The truth entered Jessica like a bullet of destruction, knocking on Kiara's right jaw, trying to analyze and forget. Trying to analyze, imagine the forgotten accident that no one wants to speak about. Kiara Pope, eight years old. Jessica Pope, 13 years old. Jessica is finally realizing that her cousin is, no, she is alive, fine, living and breathing polluted as the ivory, calling me every day, singing about how she is now in love. No one wants to face the reality of a loved one who died before they got to experience the different textures of a yellow brick road. The list of lies being snatched away, like running teeth continues to grow, like the reality of Jessica not wanting to believe that he already is gone. Seven years later, I am Jessica, who refused to let her heart hold on to any soul, afraid of them R.I.P.ing on me, because I can't face reality. I can't face the reality of you not being here with me. Kiara Pope, deceased. Jessica Pope, 15, in denial sensitivity, stuck, bang.